Hello everyone, this is Overclocked. Uh, welcome to my channel. I know it's been a while since I last posted. I'm going to try and get back into YouTube a bit. Uh, posting, I mean, maybe at least not regularly, but at least at all. Uh, I'm starting a new series of an old game I played. I'm going to do my best at not skipping any cutscenes and stuff that I've seen before. It's going to be somewhat hard for me for how many times I've played this game and seen it. This is a game I've replayed many, many times over. I really enjoyed it, and I haven't played it for a while. Uh, I'm also going to be doing something a little bit different with the recording to see if I can try to enjoy myself playing the game while recording. Is I'm not going to worry about commentary, and I'm going to add all that in and post. So when I'm speaking, and like I'm speaking now, it's over something I've already played and just trying to remember what I might have been thinking, doing, and pretending as if I'm doing it in real time. Anyway, with that said, uh, let's go ahead and get into the game. Ah yes, the book menu. That brings back memories. Last played, ooh, 2019, yeah, a long time ago. It's a bit quiet. I'm going to... Music's off. Usually how I play my games is no music. I'm not going to turn it up all the way. I'm going to make sure dialogue is definitely more audible than the rest. I also remember there's multiple control schemes I want, whatever the original is, uh, traditional, is what they call it. Um, yeah, it looks like I'm good. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let me switch on B Sync real fast. No need to go over what my monitor can do. Okay. Uh, I think change here is how you make a new one. Yes. And the default name chicken change here. Yep. Uh, right, the difficulties. Uh, heroic adds a lot of stuff. I might have fun with that later, but for now I'm going to stick with like what the game originally was, which is chicken. Uh, heroic is an anniversary thing. Uh, chicken to me is just more casual, more fun. All right, uh, I'll be quiet here. There's a intro. Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. Oh, hey, back in the game. Uh, something's wrong. I can't seem to control my character. Uh, oh, it went back to keyboard and mouse. Yeah, let me turn these back down. I guess when you set up a new character, it resets the settings. There we go, back to traditional. I guess you can't uh, have your controller settings and your mouse or keyboard and mouse working at the same time. Hey, as uh, I guess my father just said, I gotta go do some good deeds. I lost Rosie. I left her, and I can't remember where. Her stuffing needs changing today, and I can't find her. Please Rosie, help. Rosie is her teddy bear. She's a lovely little furry bear with a 
blue patch on her back. Yeah. Uh, there's more than one way to make the money at the beginning stage of your childhood. You can do the good deeds, or you can uh, find it else how. What? Uh, uh, you'll I'll probably just, notice. Um, I'm, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. But a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what, if you keep this little secret, this guy's I'll scum. give you a gold piece. Uh, no, I will not be taking your bribe. My wife. I can't let her oh, yeah, like I said, uh, there are other ways, like you can do bad things to obtain money. But I'm going to go ahead and snitch on him, let the wife know, and earn a good deep point. I'm going to try and have a mostly good character, definitely a as good of an Indian I'm as a possible. Trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially to find folk like your good self. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister. I always thought the trader and mustaches. And it seems stupidest looking got her a present yet. facial anything in so any game. That I have a love a nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face. For only three gold pieces. Yes, I'm I would. I'm afraid you oh. seem to be short of funds, Sonny. Just three gold coins is all I ask, and your sister will love them. Remember, your father will give you money if he hears good reports about you. How do you know about you? that? Get he literally just told me. Items here. Did my dad psychically tell everyone to be on the lookout for my good deeds? Honestly, where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. Yes. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. If you find him, let me know, won't you? Yes, I know where he is. He's behind a house up the hill. You have? Right. I'm going to turn him into balverine food. Thank you, young sir, for telling me. No problem. Yay, my first good deed. That's one gold coin. Wait till I get Hello, lad. Say happy birthday uh, to your sister for me, won't you? what else is there to do. Right. I want to see the guy get yelled at. Yo, filthy swine! I ought to chop them right off. The other Don't one just runs right off. me anymore! Come back to the have ya? You've got some nerve. Who is she anyway? Yeah. Some tart okay. from the village. More good deeds. Gonna be a good person. Not completely. Like, by end game, I plan on like owning every possible building to own kind of thing. And some of you already know what that entails. So I'm not gonna be exactly a good person. But I will end oh, a good oh, person. Thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? I've got to, you know. Answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right, won't be long. This my cousin is says a very the barrels boring, in these warehouses might have uh, stuff in them. Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. Come on, let's go and break um, stuff. As I was saying, there's multiple ways to earn money. Is you can there, like not do the good behavior really thing good and watch so the stock farm. You can actually like plunder it inside each place. There's some barrels you can bust up. Things. And one of them will contain a gold coin instead. Come on, this is just one of those things where you can choose your morals. Oh, you're no uh, I believe the first... Uh, time I played this game, I went absolutely evil because I usually play good and, you know, you everyone's, you know, the good thing. hero. And when I heard about this game, one of the things was is that you can just be absolutely as evil as you can. So I wanted to see how evil you can get. And Excellent. Thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. I'll let yeah, your no dad problem. know what a splendid watchman you made. Somehow, I believe he already knows. <laughs> Everyone in this town's in their psychic power. 
All right, uh, more green dots on the map will show me some other activities. What's going on here? Get him off me! Please help! He goes around the town beating up anyone smaller than him. It's usually what big people do. Look strong. I bet you could scare I mean, him off for good. Could be a jerk like him. Yep, yeah, just controls. It hurts! Ah! Ow! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Why do you have his teddy bear? Her teddy bear. <laughs> well, that's enough good deeds. I could get the box of chocolates now. The trader did say it was street gold, I believe. But how about one more? I'll go ahead and give the girl back her teddy bear. You found Rosie! Thank you so much! Come on, Rosie. Let's change your stuffing. Alright. Let's go ahead and cash in on these coins and get this uh, childhood intro wrapped up. There well done, lad. Here's your reward for those good deeds. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? Yeah, that uh, golden symbol, you'll see that a lot. That's main uh, objective markers. Uh, side quests are, would be Trade. like a silver Ooh, one. lucky I've still got these sweets. Quickly, give me three gold pieces now, and they're yours. Acts as if people are lining up to buy them. Quickly. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? One gold to spare. I didn't have to get talked to by the guards one time. Usually. Oh, I, I think it's usually because I always take that guy's bribe and tell on him anyway. And... For some reason, that makes the guards on, chase brother. after you for your bad deed. Yes. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on. I had dream I got home. chocolates too. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. Ah, cool. I like to get stuff. Oh. Tell me to search through something to get stuff, and then I search through something that has nothing. There's something wrong. Lame. Bandits! It's really happening. They're here. You've got to hide. They'll never see me behind this gigantic gapped fence. I'm invisible here. That girl should run. And that's why she should have been running. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was then they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior. He fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, 
The boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Well, this is depressing. Everything is burning. And for some reason they got my sister, even though she was literally right behind me. I don't know why she didn't just stay there. Um. Yeah. Oh no, my father. Oh, I forgot I could sprint. Yeah, I'm going to become a hero, so obviously my parents have... Well, no, that's just Batman. I don't think it's a requirement. But it happened to me all the same. We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. If it was me, I probably wouldn't trust the guy. Uh, you'd kind of be forced to, but... Hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. Something I also noticed is just how fast the uh, My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll the find Xbox, nowhere the, safer uh, in all the world. Tooltips had a purpose now. Or a better place to call your home. It's and if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training lip on screen. only we can offer. Barely time to read the first word. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. It started with nothing. So tools, tips. I have a new yet. student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Thank you for the well, vote of confidence. Follow me then. Not exactly a nice headmaster when the f new student comes in and just like, we'll you don't look like you should be here, but one of our brightest just Mez Mazes says so. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. It's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Oh, that didn't Had affect the room my recording. I haven't touched too. my mouse so long. My, but that's uh, all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Screen just turned off. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happened to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Don't want to be late. Late is definitely something I'm going to be. Because I'm going to start looting everything. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go. Those gloves are way too big for me. stuck on the floor somehow. Okay. Book. These are the main Definitely doors. want all the books. Glad we don't have You'll to sleep in here. often find like books, uh, tattoo cards, and like haircut cards uh, around here.
I'm going to try to collect absolutely everything. And not just, I mean, like, random bookshelves here. I mean everything. If it's in the game, I want it looted. That's going to be one of my goals, is to just have everything. Uh, fun fact about... Uh, I guess I can bring it up later when I get one. Uh, silver keys, I'll mention it then. Uh, that was a tattoo card, as I mentioned before. Not a big tattoo person. Don't really like the way they look. Uh, but they do give bonuses. Uh, you'll see that in... Once I get to the town, Bowerstone. No, wait. Bowerstone doesn't have a tattoo artist. I'm also getting ahead of myself. I need to try to remember not everyone's played this game. Uh, more stuff to loot. Other land. Albion's Creatures book. I'm not really big on reading. I mean, I would probably read through, well, I mean, not anymore, I know what most of them the say, here. but I, I don't like reading on a recording. I, I'm horrible at reading out loud. If I was playing alone, I'd probably skim through the books, but if there's anything that's actually important, I'll just explain it in a quick note kind of way. Okay, almost done with the library. Whiskers just watching just some random new kid go to start pulling books off the shelf and storing them who knows where on his person. This dining room is where the main meals are served. The melee ring is outside across the bridge. Alright. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do this uh challenge over here real fast. There's like a No, never mind. I'm going to go upstairs. I believe this is like Maze's office. I think I forget what it's called. The journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face? The signs are too strong to ignore, and the northern wastes have been too long that guy is a zombie. from the guild. There is much I may learn there. A vampire well, zombie. I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight. It is trying to cheat it's death fangs. again. You know clearly undead. Talk. Talk well, is of no vampires are technically undead. May death close Maybe his he's eyes just a vampire. Maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. That was Scythe. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make, of what it takes to get things done? That's all good, but not really important. I only came up here to loot. Yeah, give me that. History of the Guild. Important. Jack of Blades. I know that one's important. For some reason, I just off the top of my head know that that's one that... Uh... Once again, I'm getting ahead of the story. Uh, it's not like important main story. It's like a side thing where you donate books to a school. And it's one of the ones that you can donate. No I'm just going to... Uh... Yeah. This is the right race to the I'm going to, and talk to me in 50 seconds. right the demon door. Uh, it's the fastest route. Oh, it's pretty much only one. Um, demon doors. Hey, oh, there, I wanted to pick up that apple. Uh, can I pick up that apple? Nah, I'm just going to get the apples later. Demon drawers have some kind of uh, other challenge to them. I'm gonna skip through this. I don't know light, if it's important or if like time is clicking when you're talking to it. But basically, he says something about it being too dark. 
There, got the apple that time. Probably should have ignored the apple. I should have just ran. It's going to be close. No chance. That's amazing. How did you do awesome. it? Awesome. Made it first that. try. All right. Uh, what was I talking? Oh yeah, the demon doors. They'll have like uh, challenges behind them, and when you Ooh, complete them, they'll open up. Uh, that one is, as I was saying, it's something about it being too dark or. You finally you. prized yourself from your. I can't remember fantasy. exactly. Over Moving here. on, I'm gonna gather all of these apples before talking to the headmaster. Uh, the apples are for another like little side thing, I believe. Over here, next to this green dot, north of the map. Yeah, just in here. Gonna help her. Miss, I have to make an apple pie for the guildmaster at the end of the week. But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another four. If you find enough, can you bring them back here? I'll reward you. Yeah, sure. I'll help you find them. Thanks. Thank you so much. The guildmaster will get his pie. Here, have this. The servants Blueberry. live in here. But I gave her app. Oh no, the apples was for the headmaster's pie. She must have had an overabundance of blueberries. And I think that is the only blueberry pie in the game. Also something I don't think I'll ever actually end up eating. It will just stay there in my inventory. Forever. Alright, let's get the main story going. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. I have a feeling you're going to tell me to stop in seven hits. I'm not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. I know it's stupid, but I don't know. I think it's kind of funny. It's like, I'm gonna tell you like one way to end, but clearly state it in the UI. Ah. Now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. Fun way to uh, well done, lad. mention how now the XP then, works. We'll... That's the guild alarm. But... Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This I don't think anyone else to test says spirit. kills drop experience I'll orbs. You at the guild woods That's just a me thing. While you deal with the problem. Yeah, Once he's talking as if he knows what it is. Training. So break on my post commentary here. Um... It's kind of hard to pay attention when I might be speaking over things because I, I haven't been able to figure out any kind of settings for it, but I'm not able to hear the audio at all. The subtitles are my only hints of if something's talking. Okay, back to pretending I'm playing at the moment. Beetles! Very easy. This is pretty much sword combat uh, summed up all in one go. You get a sword and you swing. I have to say that probably the most interesting like way to mix it up would be to try to be like a spellcaster. But I'm almost always melee. I've earned 9 dick experience. That'll unlock nothing. Oh, that's a... Uh, those are fishing spots. I'll need to get a fishing rod for those. I believe the headmaster will be waiting for me. Yeah, he's right Good there. Good work, lad. 
Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm money. sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. An early night? I already did all that. It's late. I the started with all the servants' requests. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind. But soon he had no thought other than training. And he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises. The nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster like on the other side of the I river. Never want to get up on but time. That was an hour ago. We better get going. I hate waking up. Race you there. I'm still tired. I want to stay in bed. I've gotten much taller. I've already looted the place, so... I think I'll just jump on the main quest stuff now. I'll do whatever side stuff there is later. I think I'm gonna finally get a real sword. A simple one. But it's much better than a stick. Late again. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with yeah. real weapons. Yeah, real now. weapons. Get used to the weight of this sword. And let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Equip that now. Come on then. Let's see what you've got, farm boy. I think your default title should have been farm boy. Yeah. I know there used to be like a universal rule where like everything comes in threes, like three waves, three things to look for. This game seems to favor seven. At least in things like that. The start. Must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. Everyone's frozen in the background. Yeah, blocking's easy. You just hold the button. There's no like timing or. I'll hit you next time. Really, anything. You just hold it. Well done. Now let's see if you can combine ah, attack thunder, and my man. defense. Ah, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, have you? You could say that. Whisper told me you got a training with some farm boy. Maze thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha. <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learnt the most in their training. This will be a no-holds-barred duel. Just like your final melee test. Prepare yourselves. Okay. Well, I suck at this apparently. Just completely missed my first two swings. How did that get through? Ooh. That's all wrong, Whisper. You need to practice more. Shame you couldn't see me fighting. I think arena. Thunder's a good guy. He might have he really wants to see his two. sister. Keep training if you excel. want to go there yourself one day. It just doesn't seem like that because we he doesn't like you. Heroes as it is. He's fine with everyone else, and everyone's frozen again. In training. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range when you're ready to continue your lesson. Oh, and about your melee performance. Very good, lad. Keep fighting like that. The leaves are moving. Far. Maybe it's some kind of headmaster rule when he's talking. Uh, no. Then meet me by the archery I'll range just continue. to continue your training. When the headmaster's talking. No one's allowed to move. His voice Let's is more important than where you bow. need to go. To begin with, see if you can hit the three stationary targets. 
and put some effort into it. The longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. But make sure you stay within the circle. Okay. I now lock onto the target. I don't remember how to manually aim, but this is fine for now. But I remember well for a score done. reason, we did the manual hit all aim. the targets. Unfortunately, most foes don't stand still. So let's see how you fare against moving targets. You have a minute to score as many points as you can. The front target is worth one point. The middle one is worth three, and the one at the back will score you nine points. And remember, the longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage the shot will cause. More damage means more points, but you have to balance power, firing rate, and accuracy. Let's see what you can do. Come on, lad. Get your bow out. Kind of skip through the control uh, scheme thing it gave me there, and I didn't see that it just told me. So I figured it out. You click the left joystick. That was a horrible shot. That was even worse. Okay, got something on the board. Really, this one doesn't matter. I need to pay more attention. Get during the test. Out. I'm still not used to these controls. I haven't played with them in forever. And probably for reasons, you can see why I do not play as an archer. Although I'm guessing it's probably easier than trying to hit these things. Uh, with the auto lock on and all that. Okay, just 10 more seconds, mostly just not caring. All I had to do was score 10, and I'm at like 156. I think you need to score like 200 or something to get the A plus during the actual Excellent test. Shooting, my lad. You'll see what that is in do just a moment. In your skill test and I'll be most impressed. No, Next I do not want to repeat. learn about the ways of the will. Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfall. And instead of walking back, I'll just speak to him. We teleport. It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these strong dummies with lightning. All right. Let's see what you've got. I think the lightning attack is really cool, but it feels really, really weak. That's it. See how many you can hit in half a minute. Only attack dummies that are facing the center of the island. You won't get any points for hitting one on the back. You'll only waste valuable mana. Using your willpowers depletes your mana. And once used, it takes time to replenish. Yeah, uh, even when you max it out, I'll probably max it out just for fun. But it doesn't... I mean, it has an effect. I, I think it's biggest thing is it will like stun people. I'll, I'll mostly use it like if they're running away. I'll blast lightning at them and they'll just kind of be stunned there while I run up to them. But not really super effective in combat. I think at like level 4 it can do like this mass like chain thing where it will strike multiple people. But if AoE is what you're going for then you well want done. either Divine, uh, Divine Fury or something else. I probably won't be using those. I'm going to be Very melee. Very good, lad. You have learned the three hero disciplines. We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods if you wish to join her. I'm going to go ahead and play. Because I haven't done any Very of the well. side stuff. Plus, I still need to take the actual to tests. Get my free e extra stuff. Um. Can you 
Prince's yeah, let's start with this. This melee combat against Whisper counts. Right, let's get Whisper and you in the ring. Same rules as before. I have a special prize for you. I think you your grade mostly bust. depends on how much health you have left when you beat her. And I just really screwed up the start. Ah, oh, lucky shot. I know the flourishes are supposed to be like the guard break and all that, but I really hate using it. Mostly because it knocks them down, and I just... You can't swing at them when they're on the ground. You gotta wait for them to wake up. Uh, wake up, uh, stand up. Alright, you can stop now. Almost perfect. That's an A. Yeah, I didn't got a quite nice get it there. If you can get it right, this melee combat against Whisper counts. Right, let's get Whisper and you in the ring. Say, I have a special prize for you. Okay, A plus. Let's not screw up this time. How did that get through? Um. All right, you can stop now. Oh. That okay, was then. very impressive. Whisper should be ashamed. I was a worried plus. I was going to screw it up again. That great means I can award you a new weapon. I think I'd be getting. A's over and over to the point where I have to like crop some of them out of the really video just to make it look like I wasn't horrible. Archery graded. Now the guildmasters asked me to grade everyone's archery skills. And if you get an A plus, you'll receive a special prize. You've got one minute starting when you fire your first shot. Okay. Now I need to really try to focus. I'm going to screw up a lot, though. Probably. Oh, I know the first one. So I guess uh, pulling the bow, uh, the bow back completely is times four to your score. Because the back one was only supposed to be nine, and I got thirty-six. I like to say I'm doing horrible just to fill in the air, but missing only one shot, I feel like it's not that bad. I've already tied myself with uh, 20 more seconds left. I do feel like any other dummy except for the back one is completely pointless. I don't actually know that what score you need to uh, get the A+. Plus. Might be like 250. Wow. I see 250 you, being it. You set a new high score. Like a set score for wow. a lot of things. I oh, ain't never seen any better than that. You've got an A plus. The guildmaster said if anyone shot brilliant, I could award them this. I do like crossbows because it hides the arrows on your back. Whew. That was some I don't know why shooting. I don't like seeing them, but for now I'm gonna you stick really with the normal bow. Whisper. It shoots way faster and. I just don't want to deal training. with uh, reloading a crossbow and you've got 30 seconds once you've pretty sure I don't need it. to hit as many targets as you can There's once again the test is basically just students, you know. do the exact same thing that the headmaster had you do now, I almost always get 21 here but I haven't been able to get 24 I don't really know if there's much of this test like whether or not you're trying or not trying it's always the same shoot light me when you turn around and step left till you get the rest the only annoying thing is relocking onto him sometimes I accidentally lock into the uh, instructor and zap him that's astonishing then everyone Bloody gets hell. mad a plus the guildmaster said to award these items to anyone who excelled at the will test I still haven't seen anyone perform better than you. Oh yeah, the Resurrection Files. I think the other character, I, I did try Heroic, and they didn't have those. That that was an original game thing, Anniversary of the Heroic. 
you don't get resurrection files. You die, you you reload. Oh, I need I'm going to try to do as little dying as possible. Disgusting vermin. Those Only because money is involved. Are making a mess of the guild. Just look at them. I'll pay you five gold for every one you kill. Just come and see me every time you kill another one. Not really sure why you can't just let the birds be, but... I want to see if I can afford a good title name instead of Chicken Chaser uh, the moment I leave. Though probably not. I'll probably need to do at least a couple quest cards? Just quests in general. Um, before I can afford a nicer name. Yeah, my, my name right now is Chicken Chaser. People will just call me Chicken Chaser as I run around. I thought there was one on that side wall, but it didn't lot of walk onto anything. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure there was a bird over here somewhere. I remember this game a little too much. Oh, there it is. I I can't. I don't know if I if I knew I don't even want to mention how many Can times I replayed like this game. Even without the anniversary, I'd like just create like extra challenges for myself, uh, like not spending money, like no stores, which actually isn't that hard at all. Um, not leveling up that at all, which it. is also not that hard. That'd probably be pretty brutal and heroic, but in the regular game. You can beat the whole game without leveling up anything with relative ease. In fact, I think I beat the game in three hours like that. But I was also kind of rushing through it. Uh, if you really put some joy into the game, not like trying to do your own speed run, it will definitely take a lot more than three hours. I'm going to estimate at least 15. Yeah, bonus. 151. I don't know really what names are available at that price. Mm. Ooh, that was some fancy well, shooting. uh, yeah. I'm gonna go and see what uh, Whisker is up to in the Guildwoods. That's what it's called. The beetle nest is just at the top of the... Wait. Did you hear that? So it's possible just to have it's bandits back here. There. And when I was a child, if only we and the alarms went off, stream, without confirming what it was... Why he don't sent you me in with a stick. Or some of that lightning the guildmaster And it could have been bandits. I'll heal you if you get hurt. I would have died if he was wrong about the beetles. I wonder if I should cast lightning. That's right, lightning reach that far? Oh, whatever, it would take forever to kill him. Lightning does like... 10 points of damage like every half second. Which actually probably isn't um, stupid rock. That rock should not have been there. It got in my way. You all saw it. Nothing wrong with my aiming. We did it! Did you see the look on their faces? Wait till the guildmaster hears about this. Yes, guildmaster. We killed people. Are you happy? I guess that's just how it is in this world. Just some teenagers playing in the woods have to kill people. Bandits. Yay, praise. No concern. I really need to learn to just talk about some random stuff. I'm trying to force stuff out again. Hopefully I'm not sounding too stupid. Alright. Now the game really begins. Once we talk to the headmaster there. Yes. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, 
his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the Guild Seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Oh, I forgot Enter about this. Woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test Not will quite. I still have to do one more thing before I really Good have luck. free range over the game. Actually, I don't know how much free range I have. I wonder if I can just, like, book it straight to Oakville. I've never tried. I suppose you're wondering how you passed the final test then. It's simple. You must defeat me, using all you've learned in your years of training. We'll begin with your sword. Hit me, if you can. Attack me! Yeah. Very simple test. It just the three things that you did during your test. Sword, arrow, Very and good. lightning. Now, shoot me with your bow. Uh, don't get too close. Probably don't need to pull back. I can just quick fire. Yeah, this is the main reason Excellent. I didn't want to equip the uh, and finally, crossbow. Cast lightning at me. I guess I kind of remembered the back of my mind, but forgot during the moment. I wish that was a skill. Maybe just like teleport to random pots, uh, spots on the map. Like uh, an evade yes. spell. Quite impressive for a novice. You will find real battles rather more fatal than this. But you have passed your final test, and you're ready to receive your guild seal from the guild master. Wouldn't really be that practical, though. All right, now I think we uh, get our guild seals, and then we can actually head out and do well, things. Well, this is the day, lad. I remember the first night you came to us, and look at you now. Maze's faith in you was well placed. Yeah. And now come along. You thought I was nothing. The graduation ceremony will take place in the Chamber of Fate. You're on the, the list. The oldest part of the guild. Actually, he's on the list for a completely Let different reason. The apprentices approach. You'll know about that for later. For many years now, you have worked hard to earn yourself. And it's my a own opinion. Hero. Today, that apprenticeship ends, and you go out into the world to do great deeds. Deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands, or strike fear into their hearts. These are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring, and strange winds are blowing. Your choices, whether they lead you down the path of good or evil, will change. See, the that's what I don't like about him. He's the headmaster of now, this guild of heroes, guild and he is perfectly fine whether or not you want to be a good or evil person. It's like as long as you get your job done, I don't care. The guild gets their cut. It's time for you to leave us, lad. But you're still very much part of the guild. On the map table, you will find details of any quests the people of Albion wish heroes to perform. And you'll need to return often to focus all your experience into new skills. Only by doing this regularly will you advance as a hero. Step into the light, and I'll show you how to do this. Yeah, uh, you level up here. You spend your orbs. I'm not going to get anything right now. For me to teach I'll go over those you, that stuff later. To offer you I want to get this game going. Will allow me to communicate with you at like time. 50 minutes in, you will also and flashing when you have I to spend. still haven't really started I yet. A basic pack of supplies. It'll be enough for a while. 
Now there's a whole world for you to explore. Yay. Check okay, the first quest. The Wasp Menace. It's just over there in the picnic table. This is kind of like a fast forward. I don't think you ever get to do these. I think it's like someone else picked those up as if, you know, other stuff or there are other heroes doing stuff. They just kind of exist saying that you don't qualify and then they disappear on their own. Meanwhile, this, you know, rookie quest here is for you to take. But if you ask me if that's kind of something they were wanting to do, like, have it seem like other people are involved with quests, have a lot more that are grayed out. I mean, I guess that wouldn't make too much sense. Alright, let's see, uh... Oh yeah, all the names are pretty expensive. I don't think I can afford any of these. I really, really dislike Chicken Chaser. I can be... Yes. You know what? I'm rolling with it. This is my name. Let's go with it. What's the attack in the picnic area? Follow me! Follow me! Won't be here. The world Hurry! will praise that name. Hey, um, no, I can do this right now. Used to be an adventurer like yourself, but look at me now, begging to survive and getting bullied by this brat all the time. This game has a bully problem. You must be able to get rid of him so Always picking on kids and picking on Anything old people. Do, use your imagination. Expressions. I'm just gonna punch the guy. Ow, Bully the bully. You lousy heroes are all the same. Ha ha ha! Funniest thing I've seen in years. You've earned my thanks, hero. I'm sure you'll make many friends in your travels. Perhaps we'll meet again, hero. Yep. It's been a great chat. People are dying in the picnic area from wasps, but hey, that was a. Perfectly fine. Oh, you know what? They can wait a, even a little bit longer. Hey, over here! Ah, yes, silver keys. I think I mentioned that I was going to say something about this when I finally picked them up. See how it says that there's 30 of them? I also always thought that there was. Uh, I guess that's not ready yet. It'll point in some direction. I think it unlocks something. Hurry. Um. It's this way. I always thought that the keys were used when opening up a chest. So if you collected, say, seven keys, and you came up to a chest of five, after using it, you'd have two keys remaining. And I always felt that was, seemed like so limiting that it wasn't even worthwhile. So I never, ever cared about collecting uh, keys. Uh, in fact, I have yet to play a game where it's I've collected, like, more than ten and actually use any. So, now that I learned that they're just like a limiter, like as long as you have 11 keys, you can open up any chest that's 11 and under without consuming the keys. I I'm going to try and get all the keys and open up every single silver chest. Don't worry, I, I know you're under duress, but I, I need to collect everyone's food. There we go. Now I'll save you. Uh, zap. Hmm. I still wonder what victories they talk about for that sundial. Strike down the All I know about Jack is he's evil. Once again, speaking of things I shouldn't, I need to pretend other people don't know this game. It's like, More wasps have I have no idea how old it is, but it is super old. And some real experience here. Attack the wasp queen again. Nope. I entered the cutscene without using. I don't think it'll despawn though. Yeah, praise me. I killed a bug. I am the exterminator. Yeah, uh. You can take your trophies and you can show them off. I'm going to have to do that. 
As far as I know, you really only have to do that for one quest, and once you unlock that one quest with Renown, like everything else, you just automatically have the Renown to do. That'll come fairly soon. Maze is looking for you. He waits for you in the But for now, uh, finally did my first real quest, so I think I'm going to go ahead and let it end here. I'll see you all in the next video.